I'd like to make a quick video demonstrating how I'm using VCDS software on my laptop to fine tune the injection pump timing on my 1996 Volkswagen Passat turbo diesel with an AHU motor after having done the timing belt. So I mechanically got it all lined up pretty close. I'm now going to use software to fine tune it. The injection pump has four bolts securing it. This obvious one, two that are accessed behind the spinning sprocket, and then there's a fourth one under here, underneath these um, injection high pressure lines, injector high pressure lines. I've already loosened all of them, except for this one, which is just slightly tight, and I'm using a 13 millimeter wrench to tighten it and loosen it as I tweak the injection pump. In the software, here's how we use VCDS to do it. This is a fully registered version of VCDS. So I'm selecting engine, and I have to wait for it to connect via this USB cable to the serial port of my computer. This will queue up here in just one moment. There we go. And now I'm going to select basic settings. Basic settings is the mechanical settings without software input. So I could look at the injection timing right now, but currently software is making it move up and down. I'm turning off the software adjustment so we can see just the actual mechanic setting. Basic settings. We want group 000, click go. And these are some numbers that you can get information off of. And now I'm clicking TDI settings. That opens up this graph right here. First thing I want to do is come down to the bottom right corner and select my motor. I have the AHU motor. Checking, selecting your motor doesn't change the data input, but adjusts the scale so that this yellow moving line right here is on the scale. The green line rec represents um, too much injection time advance injection timing the red line is too little and the blue line is ideal the vertical axis is your fuel temperature and the horizontal axis represents the timing and the point is where they meet you want it to be at the blue line right here making it higher or lower I understand does not really affect performance rather it makes it mechanically in the middle so that the software can adjust it up and down I have just finished adjusting mine, and that's why my intersection is right near the blue line. You can click this cloud button, and it will plot what my last 100 or so um, pings are. And so it's a little bit um, below middle, but that's just fine. If I was adjusting it, I would loosen this bolt and move the injection pump forwards or aft while watching my computer to observe until this is yellow line is in the middle. So that's how it works. I just finished doing it, but I thought I had so much trouble finding this information. I thought I'd record it real quick and hopefully it'll help the next guy. Thanks for looking.